Welcome to pre-math. In this video lesson, we have got this diagram such that this line segment AB is 26, this line segment BC is 48, and this line segment CD is 29, and moreover, these line segments are perpendicular to each other as you can see in this figure and now we are going to calculate the distance between points A and D. Please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe. Before we proceed let me make it very clear that this figure may not be 100% true to the scale. So let's go ahead and get started with the solution. And here's our very first step. Let's go ahead and draw some auxiliary lines CE and AE such that AB is parallel to CE and BC is parallel to AE. Let's suppose that we have a point E somewhere here. So let's go ahead and connect this point C and E. And moreover, we are going to connect this point A to this point E. And here's our much nicer looking diagram. And here's our next step. Let's focus on this rectangle ABCE. Then according to the definition of rectangle, this side length AB is same as this side length CE. If this side length is 26, this has got to be 26 as well. And moreover, this side length BC is same as this side length AE. If this side length is 48, this has got to be 48 as well. And moreover, this whole distance DE is going to be the sum of 29 plus 26. Therefore, this distance DE turns out to be 55. And now in this next step, let's go ahead and connect these points A and D. Let me go ahead and connect this point A with this point D. And here's our much nicer looking diagram. And now we are going to calculate this distance AD. And now let's focus on this triangle AED and we know that this is a right triangle. So therefore we are going to use the Pythagorean theorem. And here's our Pythagorean theorem. A square plus B square equals to C square. And in this triangle, the longest leg AD is going to be always our side C. Let me go ahead and call this side A, this side B. So let's go ahead and fill in the blanks in this Pythagorean formula. In our case, A is 48, so it's going to become 48 square plus B in our case is 55 square equal to C square. Now let's take care of this uh, equation. Let's simplify 48 square is 2304 plus 55 square is 3025 equal to C square. So let's go ahead and add these numbers. So C square turns out to be 5329. Let's go ahead and undo this square by taking the square root on both sides, this square, and square root is gone. So therefore, our C values turns out to be 73 units. So that means our this length AD, which turns out to be equal to 70. Three. So that side is 73. So thus our distance AD turns out to be a 73 units. Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos. Bye.